Hey, I am the Mama Dia. I am going to be doing a short tutorial on this look right here. It is kind of New Year's inspired, new me, new you. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And at any time you feel like you're really enjoying this, hit the like button. I always do my eyes first. So I'm going to start with the Superstay, Maybelline Superstay Better Skin Concealer in Light. In the Jaclyn Hill palette, just go into this third shade right here. You always want to start with your crease shade. Going back in to the Jaclyn Hill palette. It is well loved. Well loved. Start that all over the crease. So I'm just going to jam it. I'm going to take this darker mocha shade. Start really close to my outer V and start pulling that and dusting it all around. I'm going in to the Carly Bible palette from BH Cosmetics. I'm gonna take this shade right here and I'm just going to soft out the edges of the dark of the crease shade so it just has that gradual fade that you want to cut my crease i use this is a high coverage maybelline master conceal and we're going to cut the crease and probably my most helpful tip is to have baby wraps. I absolutely love these liquid catsuit metallic liquid shadows by Wet n Wild is where it's at. So it comes with a little wand. So I'm just going to start patting this in as a base but taking it all the way to right here because I have a gold and I'm also going to mix with this. So let's Looks kind of funky right now, but you're going to be smoothing out these edges. I'm going to be adding the Cover Effects Glitter Drops. I love these. You can mix these in with foundation. Put some product on here. That is actually too much product. I'm going to be doing the same thing with the patting motions. It's just one of the drops that I did. It does leave you glittery. I always take this, um, take this brush to buff out the edges. So it's marrying the two. As long as you buff out those edges and go in with your original brush that you put like the dark shadow in and then you can go back over that and blend and kind of put back that darker shade the glitter in the glitter drops will kind of like just kind of sparsely go I'm going to try and deepen up just a tad bit in the crease going back into the Jaclyn Hill palette I was using this one and I'm gonna go into the shade just above that and only do that on the corners and the most important reason why I always do my eyes first because there's always fallout okay I'm gonna go ahead and do my lower lash line I'm gonna go in with the original transition shade and just run it 
lash line. It doesn't necessarily matter if you do this really messy. So I will go in with the darkest color that I've put on my outer V and start darkening up my lower lash line. I have been loving this Physicians Formula um, Rose All Day Brighten and Tighten Serum. I love this, but I mix it into my foundation because if I put it on my skin just regularly, it starts, even though I have very dry skin, um, it starts to make me a little bit oily. I am using the L'Oreal True Match Lumi in N3. This is supposed to be a bronzer, but it is very, very light. Um, and it's got shimmer in it, but you can't really see that too much. It just looks like a powder. And so I set my under eyes with that and brightened it. Absolutely love it. It is the Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. And I know they came out with new shades, but this is just bronzer. A lot of people will contour right here and contour right here. But I have a bigger forehead, five head as some people like to say. So I actually contour all around my forehead. Such an attractive angle. This blush came into my life and I have not put it down. Laura Geller Bait Blush and Brightener in Tropic Hues. want to do lashes. Of course. New Year, New Year. Lashes on. Okay, I'm going to be using, and it is the Superhero It Cosmetics Mascara. And now, all we have to do is the lips. I'm going to be using the Wet n Wild Gel Lip Liner the one in plum together and then I'm going to be taking my Hank and Henry and this is in the shade pedal pusher every truck in the state of Texas is driving um, past my house today all right I'm going to go and put on something snazzy and do my hair and I'll be right back and there you have it just a very kind of glowy look. In fact, let's do this. Yes, just make it fun. This next coming up year is your year to make anything you want of it. Just be you and sprinkle it around like glitter. Please make sure you like and subscribe and we will see you in the next one. It's starting your 